This is the Sakar Merli of the 23rd of April, 2024. Essence, sweet children, put into practice the teachings that the Father gives you. After making a promise, you must not turn away from it. Do not disobey orders. Question. What is the essence of your study? What aspect should you definitely practice? Answer. Your study is to go into retirement. The essence of this study is to go beyond sound. The father alone takes everyone back home. You children have to become Satapratan before going back home. For this, go to a place of solitude and practice being soul conscious. Only the practice of being bodiless will make you soul Satapratan. Om Shanti By considering yourselves to be souls and remembering the Father, you will become Satopratan from Tamopratan, and in this way you will become the masters of such a Satopratan world. You become Satopratan from Tamopratan in this way every cycle, and then by taking 84 births you become Tamopratan. Then the Father gives you the teaching. Consider yourselves to be souls and remember the Father. You used to remember him on the path of devotion too, but your intellects had gross knowledge at that time. Your intellects now have deep and refined knowledge. You have to remember the Father in a practical way. You also have to explain that a soul is like a star and that the Father is also like a star. It is just that he doesn't take rebirth, whereas you do. This is why you become Tamo Pratan. You now have to make effort to become Sato Pratan once again. Maya repeatedly makes you forget. You now have to become free from making mistakes. You mustn't make any mistakes. If you continue to make more mistakes, you will become even more Tamo Pratan. You receive the direction. Consider yourselves to be souls and remember the Father. Charge your batteries and you will become Sato Pratan and the masters of the world. A teacher teaches everyone. Students pass, number-wise. They then also earn, number-wise. You also pass, number-wise, and you then claim your status, number-wise. There is a difference between the masters of the world and the subjects, maids and servants. Students who are good, worthy, obedient, faithful and trustworthy definitely follow the directions of the teacher. The better your register, the more marks you will receive. This is why the father repeatedly tells you children, do not become careless. Do not think that you failed in the previous cycle. It enters the hearts of many that, because they don't do service, they must have failed. The Father continues to caution you. From being Satopratan and Golden Aged, you have become Tamopratan and Iron Aged. The world history will repeat once again. The Father shows you a very easy way to become Satopratan. Remember me and your sins will be absolved. You will become Satopratan while climbing up. You will climb up slowly and this is why you must not forget Baba. 
However, Maya makes you forget. She makes you disobedient. You accept the directions that the father gives you and you make a promise. But you then don't follow those directions. The father would then say that you are those who disobey orders and turn away from your promise. After making a promise to the father, you have to put it into practice. No one else will give you the teachings that the unlimited father gives you. There definitely has to be a change. This picture is so good. You are the Brahmin clan and will then become the Vishnu clan. This is new godly language. You have to understand this. No one else gives this spiritual knowledge. There are some organisations who call themselves spiritual organisations. But there cannot be any spiritual organisation other than yours. There is a lot of imitation. This is something new. There are very few of you. No one else can understand these things. The whole tree is standing, but it doesn't have a trunk. Later, there will be just the trunk. There won't be any branches or twigs. All of them will end. The unlimited father gives you an unlimited explanation. There is now the kingdom of Ravan over the whole world. This is Lanka, an island. That Lanka is in the ocean on the other side, and the unlimited world is also in the ocean. There is water all around. Those things are limited, whereas the Father is teaching you unlimited things. Only the one Father explains to you. This is a study. You remain engaged in studying until your results are announced and you then get a job. Your intellects work on just that. It is a student's duty to pay attention to his studies. While sitting, walking and moving around you have to stay in remembrance. This study remains in the intellects of you students. Students work hard during examinations so they do not fail. They especially go to a park to study in the morning because the vibrations of noise in the house are dirty. The father has explained, instill the practice of being soul conscious and you won't then forget. There are many places for solitude. In the beginning, after you finished class, you would go to the hills. Now, day by day, knowledge is getting deeper. Students remember their aim and objective. This study is for going into the stage of retirement. No one, apart from this one, can teach you this. Sages and holy men all teach you devotion. Only the one father shows you the way to go beyond sound. Only the one father takes everyone back home. This is now your unlimited stage of retirement that no one knows about. The father says, children, all of you are in the stage of retirement. The whole world is in the stage of retirement. Whether someone studies or not, everyone has to return home. All souls will go to the incorporeal world and will go down to their own sections. The tree of souls that is created is wonderful. The cycle of this whole drama is absolutely accurate. There cannot be the slightest difference. There are lever and cylinder clocks. Lever clocks are very accurate. Here too, the intellect's yoga of some of you is like a lever clock, whereas that of others is like a cylinder clock. 
Some are not able to have yoga at all. It is as though the clock is not working at all. You have to become like a complete lever clock because only then will you go into the kingdom. Whereas those who are cylinders will become part of the subjects. You have to make effort to become a lever clock. The saying, a handful out of multi-millions, only refers to those who are to claim a royal status. They are the ones who become threaded in the rosary of victory. You children understand that this truly does take effort. They say, Baba, I repeatedly forget you. Baba explains, Children, the stronger you become, the more powerfully Maya will fight you. They have to be very cautious in wrestling. Strong ones recognize strong ones. It is the same here. There are Mahavir children and they too are number wise. Maya brings very strong storms to the very good Maharatis. Baba has explained, no matter how much Maya troubles you and brings you storms, you just have to remain cautious. You must not be defeated by any situation. Although storms come in your thoughts, you must not perform those actions with your physical organs. Storms come to make you fall. If there were no battle with Maya, how could you be called strong wrestlers? You must not be concerned about the storms of Maya. However, while moving along, you become influenced by your physical organs and immediately fall. This father explains to you every day, you must not perform any sinful actions through your physical organs. If you don't stop performing unlawful deeds, you will claim a status worth a few pennies. Internally, you yourself understand that you will fail. Everyone has to return home. The Father says, if you remember me, that remembrance is never destroyed. By remembering me even a little, you will go to heaven. You understand what status you will receive by remembering me a little, and what status you will receive by remembering me a lot. What each one will become cannot stay hidden. Each of you can understand for yourself what status you would attain if you were to have heart failure now. You can even ask Baba. As you progress further, you will understand this for yourself. Destruction is just ahead. Storms of rain and natural calamities do not first ask you before they come. Ravan is already sitting here. This is a very big examination. Those who pass claim a high status. Kings have to be very wise so that they are able to look after their people. Only a few pass the ICS examination. The Father teaches you and makes you into the Satapratan Masters of Heaven. You know that from Satopratan you have become Tamopratan and that you now have to become Satopratan by having remembrance of the Father. You have to remember the Purifier Father. The Father says man man above. This is the same episode of the Gita. This Gita is for becoming double crowned. It is the Father who makes you that. You have all of this knowledge in your intellects. Those who are intelligent are able to imbibe it well. Acha. To the sweetest beloved, long lost and now found children, love, 
Remembrance and Good Morning from the Mother, the Father, Baptada. The Spiritual Father says Namaste to the Spiritual Children and the Spiritual Children say Namaste to the Spiritual Father. Now we have a night class from the 5th of January 1969. You children are sitting here in class and you know who your teacher is. Students remember who their teacher is all the time, but here you forget it. The teacher knows that the children repeatedly forget him. You have not found such a spiritual father before. You only meet him at the confluence age. In the Iron Age and in the Golden Age, you only have physical fathers. This one reminds you that it should be firm for you children that this is the confluence age, in which you children become the most elevated human beings. So... By remembering the Father, you should remember all three. When you remember the teacher, you should remember all three. And when you remember the Guru, you should remember all three. You definitely have to remember this. The main thing is to become pure. Those who are pure are called Satopratan. They reside in the Golden Age. You have been around the cycle and it is now the confluence age. The Father comes every cycle and teaches you. You reside with the Father, do you not? You also know that he is the true Satguru and that he truly shows you the path to the lands of liberation and liberation in life. According to the drama plan, we make effort and follow the Father. We receive teachings here and follow him. Just as this one studies, so you children also make similar effort. If you want to become deities, you have to perform pure actions. No rubbish should remain. The main special thing is to remember the Father. You understand that you forget the Father, his teachings, and also the pilgrimage of remembrance. By forgetting the Father, you also forget the knowledge. You even forget that you are students. You should remember all three. If you remember the Father... You will also definitely remember the teacher and the Satguru. When you remember Shiv Baba, you also need divine virtues. There is magic in remembrance of the Father. No one else can teach you children the magic that the Father teaches you. We become Satopratan from Tamopratan in this birth itself. It takes a whole cycle to become Tamopratan and now we have to become Satopratan in this one birth. It depends on how much effort each of us makes. It isn't that the whole world makes effort. Those of other religions will not make this effort. Children have had visions of how the founders of the religions come. They have played their parts in such and such a dress. They go into the Tamopritan stage. Your understanding also says that just as you become Satopritan, so everyone else will also become this. You take the donation of purity from the Father. Everyone calls out. Liberate us from here and take us back home. Become our guide. According to the drama plan, everyone has to return home. You have returned home many times. 
Some do not stay at home for the full 5,000 years, and some stay in the home for the full 5,000 years. They come here at the end, and so it would be said they have stayed in the land of peace for 4,999 years. We would say that we have been in this world on this earth for 4,999 years. You children have the faith that you have taken 83 or 84 births. Those who are very clever would definitely come first. Acha. Love, remembrance and good night to the sweetest spiritual children. Essence for Dana, 1. In order to become Sato Pritan, charge your battery with the pilgrimage of remembrance. Become free from making mistakes. Keep your register good. Do not become careless. 2. Do not perform unlawful actions. Do not be concerned about the storms of Maya, but become a conqueror of your physical organs. Make effort and become accurate, like a lever clock. Blessing May you be a charitable soul and receive happiness, power and everyone's blessings from the service you do. The instant and visible fruit of doing service is to receive happiness and power. The service you do to enable souls to claim the inheritance from the Father is an act of charity. Those who perform charity definitely receive blessings. All the thoughts of happiness that are created in the hearts of all the souls become blessings for you and are accumulated for the future. So always consider yourself to be a server and you will constantly continue to receive happiness and power which is the imperishable fruit of your service. Slogan Remove any curtain of obstacles with the power of your thoughts and words and you will be able to see the benefit behind that curtain. Om Shanti